Hello everyone, it's Insane Raven here, and as you saw from the title, we'll be doing a video on Jeffree Star liquid lipsticks. And uh, if you don't know who Jeffree Star is, just go to his channel. You should know who he is by now. He's done music, he's done makeup, he's all over everywhere. I know some people have their controversies over his behaviors and whatever, but we're not here to talk about his, you know, person. We're here to talk about all of these sexy things in my hand. I have six different shades of his velour liquid lipsticks, and uh, uh, three of them are my sister's, who is sitting over there because she's hanging out with me today, and three of them are mine because he did a like 50% off sale and we were like, uh, we're buying them right now. <laughs> So, I'm really excited to make this video, and I hope you all enjoy it. I know this won't be very catered to men unless you do fabulous makeup, which if you do, good on ya. And, uh, yeah, we're just gonna get into it, so... <laughs> okay, so pricing for these liquid lipsticks, each one, just regularly, which is... You're gonna think I'm insane when I'm saying this. It's Insane Raven, I know, but I'm being honest here. They're $18.00 just by themselves, not even including tax or shipping, just one of these, $18. And I guess like, because they are really good lipsticks, they can't be worth that much, but uh, I don't have the money. <laughs> so when he said he was going to be doing a 50% off thing, I was ecstatic because that means everything is $9, which is what I wished they were at regularly because then I would have a million of them. Uh, <laughs> but, me and my sister planned and we chose our shades and we got three each and that came out to be I think 60 something dollars without the half off it would have been like over a hundred which is a big deal so thankfully we got all the ones we wanted we had even an extra list because we were like okay if these are sold out we're getting these because we're getting some <laughs> okay anyways so we bought them and we were like, oh, good, none of them were sold out. And then the shipping and the thing said it was going to be five to seven days, business days or whatever. And I think I got it like a week and a half after we bought them, which is pretty good. I mean, when I first got them, I was like excited. And I, uh, we have opened these. I don't have the actual box here with me. I just have them because I wanted to test them out and we wanted to swatch them and everything before I made this video. And we were just way too excited, so, sorry, I didn't have the box, but, uh, the packing was really, the, the packaging was really good, it came in a pink box that was, like, this big, and, uh, it was wrapped up in this pink bubble wrap, and this pink Jeffree Star logoed wrapping paper, and it also came with this photo of, nope, glare, of Jeffree over here, and then, uh, his, like, crew, or whatever. I don't know all of them, I just know him and Nathan, basically. But, yeah. The packaging was really good, it was really cute. Even though I don't personally like pink that much, it's... It's pretty good. Pretty good, good for him. He's always very good at packaging. And I appreciate about that. Appreciate that about him. I can't talk today, I'm sorry. I, I will, I will just ramble through everything. <sighs> okay, so, talked about that. Now, I am going to swatch all six of these. I'm going to swatch them on my arm, and this is my first swatch video, so if you're a guru, please don't hate me, okay? I try. I'm going to do my best, okay? I'll get better as time goes on, but, yeah. I'm just going to swatch all these on my arm, and then I'm going to do a lip swatch, even though my lips are tiny. I want you to see how they look on the face and then I'm going to explain how long they last and how good they are and whatever. Okay guys just before we get into the swatches review and all of that um, I just wanted to talk about the packaging a little bit more. These pink and silver are the signature Jeffree Star packages that he always uses for these liquid lipsticks. The silver and pink is part of one of the collectors additions that he made recently. I'm pretty sure it was the winter one. Maybe not. I can't remember exactly, but that is why that one is different from the rest. And, um, yeah, so let's get into the rest of the video. All right, guys, so the first shade I have here is, of course, Drug Lord, the one I showed right before this. And here I'll just, I'm just opening it and showing you the applicator. It is a chair-shaped, um, 
The stick part is very clear, so you can see all the makeup all over it. Here is the swatch. It is a very sheer shade because it is hard to create. You'll see it on my lips. The first application is not the most opaque, but you can always layer it up and make it look a lot better. I was just making... I just wanted to show you guys the first application and what it will look like when you first put it on. And um, if you layer it up, it will look way better. It, as you can see, it makes your teeth look a bit more yellow if you have yellower teeth. But it is a very nice shade for makeup looks especially, and I really like it, considering the sheerness of it. Now the next shade I'll be showing you is called Flamethrower, and I got this for the surprise that'll be happening later on in my next video most likely, but as you can see here is a more uh, creamy application. It's a lot more clear and opaque on my skin tone. And here you can see that the applica the first application is a lot better than Drug Lord because it is not that hard of a color to create, but it does look a lot better considering, you know, first application all. But I really like this color and I can't wait to keep using it later on. And it doesn't make your teeth look super yellow. The next shade I have here is Flamboyant. This is the one that came in the silver packaging. I'm just showing off the way it looks and of course showing you the applicator as it is clear as well in this one. The swatch on this one was a bit thicker but it was very easily applied. On my lips, as you can see, it's very pink and it's not my color at all. And uh, it does make my teeth at least look a bit more yellow, in my opinion. But I do like the shade on my sister and I'm sure that people who love pink will love this color. <laughs> now this fourth shade is called Rich Blood, and after uh, applying this to myself, I actually regretted not buying this color, as it seemed to look very good on my face, as you'll see in a few seconds, but this swatch was a bit more rough. This is a bit more of a thick liquid lipstick, but I like it a lot. See, as you can see here, excuse my application, that was not the best, but it's a very nice, rich, of course, rich toned red, and it looks very nice when applied good. <laughs> and it does actually make my teeth look better than usual, which I do very much appreciate. Now this next one is called No Tea No Shade, and uh, it was a very brown toned purple. Or, yeah, purple. <laughs> Sorry, I got mixed up with a different color. And, uh, of course, I'm just showing you the applicator, as it is, on all of them, a chair shape. And, uh, this swatch was a bit more creamy. I actually messed up a little bit. That's why it's a bit thicker, sadly. And then, moving on to the lips. I like it on myself, but I think it does look better on my sister than me. I could work it on some things, and excuse the stain around my lips. That was from the last color. And uh, it did make my teeth look a little bit yellow, but that's just me, so this shade is very nice and I uh, like it a lot. Alright guys, well this is the last shade I have for you and it is called Abuse. This is actually my favorite color of the bunch, and uh, I've actually worn it a few times if you saw in my photos. This is my favorite swatch that I did of this color. Um, and I'm speaking a little fast because I'd like to say something about the brand. I do love the brand, and I appreciate how much work and effort he puts into this. They're, all of these lip liquid lipsticks are vegan and cruelty-free, and there's, like, no harsh chemicals. They're very lightweight on your lips. I, like, I've eaten with them, I've drank with them. They all feel very nice, and uh, I really do love this brand, so I will hopefully be able to buy more eventually. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this review, and if uh, you liked it, give it a comment, blah 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 blah, you know? Thank you. Well there you guys go, I hope you enjoyed that video, and that someday I can do another one of these Jeffree Star hauls. I will be making some more um, videos soon. I'll be doing a, another short film with my sister. If you want to do the, if you want to watch the first video, just scroll down. Or I can figure out how to link it down below. Um, and I'll be doing some unboxings and hopefully some other very cool things. Here's all the swatches on my arm. I did it from like light to dark. It looks like a rainbow. It's really nice.
anyway, yeah, I'll be putting all of my social media into the description as someone commented I should do. So I'll be doing that from now on. And uh, a surprise might be coming in the next video. You'll probably notice something different. Anyways, <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next video. I hope you enjoyed this one, as I said again, because I ramble on, I have ADHD. I don't know. I'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye.